Douglas Phillips with VMworld Television, standing at the Genius Bar with Eddie Donnell. How are you, Douglas? Good. So uh, I've got to ask the obvious question. Eddie, are, are you a genius? I, I am not a genius, but I'm happy to stand in front of the Genius Bar. That's, you know, it's a nice place to be. All right, no worries. So I do have a question for you, though. I happened to be by the keynote this morning and saw that uh, you were talking about vCloud Director. Absolutely. Well, we announced vCloud Director was officially available this morning. It's really the first solution that allows you to bridge your public clouds and your private clouds by using the same management infrastructure on both sides. We demoed some of the, uh, the ability to connect them with vShield Edge. We demoed the, the user interface that we've created to allow end users to consume that capacity in a way that's much more understandable, much easier to use than traditional management tools are. All right, and um, what are a couple of the really key features or cool features that you think everybody out there should know about uh, vCloud Director? Absolutely. The first and biggest thing is there's an abstraction layer that we've built on top of your existing infrastructure. That abstraction layer allows people to consume capacity without having any idea how it's provided to them. And that builds that separation that Steve Harrod talked about in the keynote between IT producers and IT consumers. And that separation is really the fundamental thing that makes cloud possible. We're delivering that with vCloud Director. All right, and people, you said they can get this today. Absolutely available today. Evals are live on the website as of uh, midnight last night, so uh, we're ready to go. All right, great. I think uh, when I get back to London, I'll be checking it out. Excellent. That's good to hear, man. So one last question. Uh, how easy is it for people to integrate this into their environment today if they're already using uh, you know, vSphere, vCenter? Absolutely. It's a straightforward add-on on top of vSphere and vCenter. We'll take resource pools from vCenter and data stores from vCenter and aggregate those together into what are called provider VDCs. And that's then essentially an implementation of a service tier. And that's what you manage as a provider inside of Redwood, inside of vCloud Director. You turn around and take those provider VDCs and allocate capacity to different organizations. Those different organizations can then take that capacity and consume it in a really easy to use self-service fashion. So straightforward to get started with, straightforward to use, building on top of all of the technology that's already been delivered from VMware. All right, great. And uh, for the people that are here all week, uh, I understand there's one or two labs already there, available. There's there's two labs in the lab staff room or in the in the VMworld labs room, which if you haven't seen it already, is is unbelievable. It's mind blowing how cool it is this year. So definitely go ahead and check out the the install labs, the vCloud API labs, and some other stuff as well. All right, I think we might uh, go straight over there actually and check awesome. it out and see what people are saying about your labs. Awesome. I look forward to it. Great. Thanks a lot, Eddie. And you, uh, I don't care what they say. I think you're a genius. Well, I appreciate that. Thanks. Sir. <laughs> see you, Eddie. See you. Uh, hi there, I see that you're doing the vCloud Director Networking Lab? Yes. So, uh, did, did you hear about vCloud in the general session this morning? I did, and actually had an interest in it because I work for a partner and we are currently a cloud provider. And so a lot of the stuff that vCloud brings to the table are things that we have been trying to do to cobble together. And so for us, it's interesting to find a nice polished interface um, that allows us to do this for our customers. So it really changes the, the game for us. That's great, and uh, so far, you happy with what you're seeing? Very happy, yes. The labs have performed really well, and it's really exciting that it will really simplify what we do, which allows us to deliver better solutions for our customers. What made you interested in this? Uh, I'm working as a consultant helping some very large clients to find private cloud environments and the cloud director shows significant promise as being a key component in that discussion. Uh, I like some of the orchestration and the way they're exposing the APIs, and I figured going through the lab would give me a better understanding of some of the in intricacies that I hadn't seen. And the lab, pretty easy to use, uh, pretty in-depth. What, what do you guys think? Yeah, look, it's working well. Um, you know, we were able to get into the product and play around, so that's, that's the main thing for us, and the lab's taking us through the, the steps we need to, to get it running. So. Is this lab helping you to, to understand the product better? Oh. What, what do you think of the lab? Oh, definitely. Uh, um, in fact, I, we have many problems. For, we, we have many challenges with, with network because uh, we are also network providers. So we are testing the networking model, and it, it is very useful for us.